Heavy metal drummer, entrepreneur and radio podcast host Rodney Holder has throughout the decades lived the dream every aspiring music fan wishes to pursue. From touring around the globe with his psychedelic metal band, Alchemist, to being written up in internationally renowned music publications such as The Rolling Stones and Blunt Magazine, Rod has been a major figure throughout the decades in the ever-changing Aussie metal scene. Hey Rod, pleasure to meet you. I'm Rachel. And today I'd love if you could share some experiences of the past 25 years you've had in the music industry. Sure, I'd love to Rachel, that'd be great. So Rod, your career definitely hasn't been a bland one. Could you tell us about your proudest moments in your career to date? I guess probably playing grass pop in uh, Belgium. Hellfest in France to like 40, 50,000 people. Probably the, probably the pinnacle of my music career. So coming from such a colourful musical background, mm -hmm. what is it specifically about podcasts that have caught your interest? Well, initially, um, as a part of my teaching, because I'm also a music business teacher and coach, and I was I was never the, the person to say, I know, I know everything about the music business, so I wanted to speak to other industry professionals and experts and performers and managers and booking agents and concert promoters. and So I started doing that just to get a different perspective to give my students. So obviously podcasts are central to both yourself and your career at the moment. I'm just interested to know with your website musicbusinessfacts.com, where are you wanting to see it in five or ten years from now? I would love to see that I've done at least 500 interviews, would be really good. Um, and I suppose I would like to see it recognised as a, uh, a worldwide resource in the music business for people to turn to, to find out you know, the truth, the facts behind the business of music. Rod, can you tell us about who you pitch your podcast to? Absolutely. I, I like to interview people that are going to be able to actually give some takeaways to my audience. So I like to approach uh, anyone who really has some um, runs on the board and success within their chosen, chosen field of the industry, whether it be as a performer, as a businessman, as a, a technical expert or some other sort of miscellaneous component of the music industry. So I really want to make sure that my guest can not only tell a good story but also bring some interesting uh, knowledge to uh, budding music industry entrepreneurs, performers, songwriters, managers, agents, concert promoters, um, you know, really any sort of entrepreneurial vision. What can young aspiring musicians hope to get out of your podcasts? I think just honest reality truths about what goes on behind, you know, putting on a show or doing a tour, um, getting signed, um, understanding music publishing, um, contracts, copyright, you know, just that sort of base knowledge that makes the industry go, go around. Lastly, Rod, what would be your number one piece of advice to give to musicians hoping to break through in their musical career? I think the, the reoccurring theme that I always get from uh, just my own research and a lot of the guests that I speak to is that you have to have good music, that's obvious, but that's only a part of it. So the first part would be to, to write good songs and to hone your songwriting craft to be the best performer that you possibly can, um, to develop your image so that you look visually interesting, um, to work really hard and um, be persistent in, in that work ethic because um, there's really, it's very unlikely that you'll be an overnight success so you need that persistence to keep going. And then of course to, um, to become educated about the business side of the music industry because I like to quote Paul Stanley from KISS, he says, well if, if you don't look after the business side of your music then someone will be looking after it for you and uh, they'll be taking a big slice of your pie. Great advice. Thanks very much. Thank you for your time. You're very welcome. Being directly involved in the Australian music scene since 1987, Rod Holder diligently continues to guide rising musical industry talent through the complex twists and turns of the constantly evolving musical realm. Whether you're an aspiring musician, promoter, manager, publicist or agent, Rod is committed to fast-tracking your career and furthering your reach within the music business world.